Today, Congressman Gibson was at the Thompson House honoring 103-year-old Ruth Milliet. Today, he gave her the Women's Veterans Challenge coin, a coin that will inspire other women veterans to get the help they so well deserve. We spent some time uh, with Ruth Milliet, who is the most senior female Marine in our country. At 103 years young, is still very vital, vibrant, uh, funny, uh, and a great example for all of us. As she accepted the coin, she wanted to make it clear that she was accepting it on behalf of all female veterans who have served. So, you know, that just strikes you as somebody who has just such a sense of service to others. It was clear. And then you could tell just by her smile that she's somebody who's feel very comfortable in the way she's lived her life and doesn't appear to have any regrets. From the stories I've heard from family, she lived a remarkable life both professionally and personally. A very happy marriage and uh, family that uh, with us to this day as a, as a result of that. And uh, somebody who I think really represents all that's good in our country and, and particularly rising to the occasion in a very challenging moment, uh, that being the Second World War. We encourage our veterans that receive these to pay them forward give them to another female veteran that does not access VA care currently. The number on the back will actually get them in touch with someone that can tell them what they uniquely are eligible for. So depending on where they served or what their criteria or their length of service, this gets them in touch with the people that can give them the right answers. Actually just under a third of all the veterans who are eligible uh, to get care at the uh, VA sign up. So, you know, moments like now, like this event where we're celebrating uh, Ruth's incredible life, this is also a, a, an, an opportunity for us to spread the word about these services so that we can get more veterans to actually sign up for the VA, including our female veterans.